In the immense floating world of the sea, food drifts in and out of view. The sea is a soup, a very dilute broth of small plants, animals, and their remains. Eating this suspended food requires special adaptations. Large to small, from whale to worm, scallop to sea pen, these are the filter feeders, animals with the remarkable ability to find and concentrate food suspended in water. Their challenge is to sift through enormous volumes of water to find their sustenance. The largest animals in the world are filter feeders. Here, humpback whales lunge through schools of small fish. Thousands of gallons of water stream out of their mouths, leaving anchovies trapped on fringed filter plates called baleen. Just as whales strain fish, anchovies strain small animals called copepods. Swimming with their mouths wide open, anchovies capture these animals on gill rakers, bony filters along the anchovies' gills. The copepod faces the same challenge. Lots of water to comb for little food. It feeds on microscopic plants called diatoms at the base of the oceanic food chain. As much as they range in size, filter feeders vary in technique. Some, like this copepod, create currents by paddling their appendages. Copepods detect diatoms in the currents and direct these morsels into their mouths. Bryozoans are an example of other marine organisms that scan and trap their food. Like many animals in the sea, barnacles are immobile and must rely on currents to bring food to them. They filter minute plants and animals through net-like legs. Other bottom-dwelling organisms, such as sponges and tunicates, also sieve for their food. Some animals, like this snail, use sticky surfaces to capture food from the water. This snail secretes a mucus net that traps floating particles as they drift by. Various species of sea cucumbers feed with sticky surfaces, as do this brittle star and this jellyfish. A variety of animals filter their food from the sea. Some swim slowly, others dwell on the sea floor. Wherever they are, the ocean's restless motion provides these animals with a constantly replenished food source. <laughs>